Good luck, dude. Robert S. Is that you, Robert Sanders? Ben, where, 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 are you new here, Ben? Brand new, or how'd you find me, buddy, dude, homie? I mean, Vince still looks good, thank God. Be a sad day when he's like a really old man and come out in a wheelchair. Otani. How about a Francisco Arcia? Freshman Flash. Recommendation on another break? Mm. I don't know. Get more teams in the Spectre so we can open that bad boy. Hey, where'd you come from? So you're brand, are you brand new to breaking or brand new to TSB? I like to ask questions because I am the owner and founder of this joint. So I like to know where people come from, how they got here. Sometimes they come referred from a friend or a regular. They see me on Facebook, Twitter, social media. Sometimes they see a contest I was running and they got in that. I don't know. I just like to know. Helps me in my marketing. Oh, there you go. Yeah, he used to be a customer here. I forget what his name is. I just talked to him last week, actually, or two. I was trying to sell him some stuff. He used to be a customer here. Big customer. Blake, maybe? Is it Blake? He's a good dude. But he was a customer here for a long time, and then he, like many people, went off and started his own breaking operation. <laughs> I lost a lot of customers to wanting to become breakers. So I appreciate you uh, sharing in the breaks. Green Bowers. Jacob. I got one of these left. You feel free to take it. The last one. Dude. So I'm not tempted to open it. It's a straggler box, the last one. For some reason, those have always been crazy.
Rowdy to 99. Oh, dear collector. Going to go ahead and get a Danny Jansen. Boo. Oh, snap. The Rock is here. What? <laughs> oh, cool. Pardon me, but The Rock just came on. I haven't seen him in years in a live event other than WrestleMania last year. Oh, there you go, Benjamin R. Let's find out what's in it. Thanks. Of course, it was a great promo. In fact, I'm not going to watch it now because I really, really, really want to watch it. You know what I mean? I want to engage with it. I want to focus on you guys right now. So that's that. Here's the last one. It looks like there's three optic left. Benjamin, are you in the right chat? Are you in the TSB Live Breaks chat? Because I have two chats. You might be in the Top Shelf Breaks chat room. Does everybody see Benjamin R? Or is he over there in his in his own world? I haven't seen The Rock's promo yet, but it'd be cool if he looks at Baron Corbin and goes, Who in the blue hell are you? And he would say, Well, my name is... It doesn't matter what your name is. I bet he does that, and I haven't even seen it yet. Yeah, if you go to the website, there's a link. That link should take you to the main chat room. Yeah, I think you guys are in the... Wrong chat, or maybe I can't see my other chat. What's going on here? Yeah, you two are over in Top Shelf Breaks chat room, it looks like. You need to be in the one that says TSB. Right, TSB regulars over in the other main chat? It's TSB Live Breaks. YouTube.com backslash TSB Live Breaks. Go subscribe to that channel. You can wait till after this box, though. So. Carlos Santana, 299er. Who are you looking for in this? Got a favorite player, favorite team? Mm -hmm. 
We want a super fractor. Top's chrome is nice and shiny and easy to open. Starlin Castro, 99er Otani. My favorite wrestler? Um, I mean, I'm not trying to take the cop out answer, but to pick a favorite, I couldn't do. But I could narrow it down. I could narrow it down to Hogan, Shawn Michaels, and The Rock. <laughs> you know, just pretty much everyone's three favorites. The legendary dudes. I had a weird happenstance meeting with Shawn Michaels at my church one year, a couple years back. He was filming a movie uh, at our church that was the producers of the movie or something. We were sitting in church waiting for it to start, you know, people are milling about. About five minutes before 9 a.m. before they get started. And uh, I'm we're sitting in the back because we had our son. He was like... I don't know, seven, eight months old at the time. So we were sitting in the back in the parent section with kids. There's a walkway in front and then the main congregation. Well, right in front of me, right in front of me walks Sean Freaking Michaels. Just ch chilling through church. I said, honey, that's Sean Michaels. Look, that is Sean Michaels. He had on his black uh, vest, motorcycle, like Harley Davidson vest. Had his hair back and a ponytail. It was definitely Sean Michaels. The whole church sermon, I have no idea what they even talked about. So afterwards, I said, I got to go side, say hi to him, man. I got to go find out what's going on, why he's here. So after church, we went down and introduced myself to him, said hello, and he just stood there and talked to us. He wasn't at a convention. He wasn't at a show. He wasn't on. He was just Shawn Michaels. And I felt weird because I didn't want to take selfies and pictures and... I should have at least taken a picture. He took our son and was holding our son, you know, and uh, I guess I felt weird like taking pictures of him because it was in church and he was trying, you know, trying to respect that. Sweet church music. <laughs> yeah. They were filming a movie and if I really thought about it, I can remember the name of the movie. It's one of those Christian movies came out five years ago or so. And I distinctly remember because there was a pay-per-view that night. It was a Sunday. And I was a little tongue-tied. I'm not going to lie to you. I was a little tongue-tied, mostly in disbelief. Like, why is Shawn Michaels here in my hometown, in my church, just standing here chatting with me like any other congregation member? It was too weird. It was actually kind of surreal and weird. But I said, so what are you doing, man? He goes, well, I'm filming this movie. We have about another seven to ten days till we finish it up. I'm staying at a local hotel down the road. And I should have been like, dude, I'll rent the pay-per-view tonight. We'll get some Chicago-style pizza. Come on over to the crib and watch. I won't go on social media or anything. We'll make a deal of it. Just come hang out. And I didn't ask him that. And I'm really, honestly, I really believe that he might have entertained that idea of coming over and hanging out, getting some Chicago pizza, which he loves, and just watching. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? I can only imagine. So, and I've always loved Sean. I think he's one of the greatest of all time. Hogan and Flair and The Rock get all the attention in Triple H. But Shawn Michaels, I think, is a goat. There's many times he's been wrestling uh, the the champion. Look at this auto from Ryan O'Hearn. Hello. Who does that? I just happen to have one box of Sterling left. Just saying. Straggler box too. In fact, I just put it up there. I tried to hide it from myself. Mm. 
Should have an auto in this pack, right? One auto should be in here. This isn't this is what they call a hot pack on eBay, right? <laughs> I do. Well, I'm a music guy. I've been in music my whole life, so I, I know a lot of songs. There he is. Jeffrey Springs. <laughs> I can only imagine. It's a beautiful song. Man, dude, sorry I couldn't pull a monster out of there for you. I know you love the chrome anyway, and I priced it pretty good. Got these other art, these little guys too. I think they're 45 bucks. You like that, Springs? From Texas? You're a music guy? Oh, cool. Yeah, I got into, I got into commercial radio uh, back in the 80s. I was that kid that called the radio station all the time trying to get on the air in the 80s. Used to call up and try and win every hour, win tickets, uh, albums. I'd go to all the radio station events, and I ended up turning that into a career of 20 years in commercial radio and records promotions, working for the major record companies and uh, radio. That was my life. It's like a secret life not many people know. Oh my god! I think I'm cute. I know I'm sexy. Alright, I'm gonna get his box over in the back, get that packed up to get shipped out tomorrow. And we'll look at what other breaks are filling for the night. Probably start with some high end stuff. Hello? Hello? Agape. Yes, hi. Their knees get weak whenever I'm around. They see me walk. They hear me talk. I make them feel like they're on cloud nine. I'm just a sexy boy. I'm not your boy toy. I'm just a sexy boy. Woo! 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 My name's Rick Flair. Hands off the merchandise. My name's Rick Flair. Called me on the phone. Howard, my name. The man. I know I'm sexy. Woo! I've got the looks. Woo! Woo! That drives the girls wild. I've woo! Woo! That really move them. Woo! I said chill. Woo! There you go. Just a little bit of Shawn Michaels since we're talking about him. All right, I'm hitting refresh on the website, checking all the break spots, and here is what I see. You like I was rocking that soundboard, dude. Sometimes I do remixes. All right, we can get some uh, Spectra done here quickly. Benjamin Rush. Spectra. James G with the Dolphins. Three, six... There's only be a few teams left in Spectre 1. XR's filling up. Keith Crumb, thank you. Flawless Treasures. We could do the Treasures portion. Two left in the Spectra. Right here, dudes. 
close this out. We'll open it right now. That's right, Joey Cantrell, sexy boy. I got to find out what's in these uh, final seven signature series boxes. Man, Triple Threads baseball is looking dope. There is a ton of cool stuff coming out in the next two or three weeks. This is the only week where it's kind of low-end, entry-level products, as I call them. Impeccable football? That's better than National Treasures, I think. Personal opinion. Uh, one left in the Spectra. Cool. How was Mexico, dude? Oh. Benjamin Rush. Oh! What a rush! Close it out. Three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten! Looks like you're having a good time, man. Seriously. Like, living it up. Enjoying it. Everybody see Benjamin? Yeah, dude, especially now. Business should be booming for you. I know our business is booming, Robert, as brokers here in Chicago. 